Hi everyone, welcome back to Ute Demo Fridays. We're going to have a look at some Magic Fluke Blue ukuleles next. This was a request from Laura. Thanks Laura on Facebook. If you've got any requests you'd like to make for next week, um, let me know and I'll demo what I can for you. So I've got massive respect for Magic Fluke Company um, because they've been a real um, great involvement in the ukulele world, um, not just in making and promoting ukes but teaching as well. Um, absolutely fantastic family run business based in the States. And they came up with this really, it's almost iconic now, isn't it? The Magic Fluke headstock, um, which is almost like a centered out square headstock. They've got friction pegs on these. They do do them with um, uh, geared um, peg head tuners as well. Um, plastic back and sides with a plywood top, which can have some really, really attractive designs. That's the Tiki King design on it. Or sometimes a solid top, like this solid coral one. What I love about these is they're so comfortable to play. They've got quite a narrow D-shaped neck, which is beautifully carved. And the action on these straight from the factory before I even get my hands on them is incredibly low. So they're one of, what a really, really brilliant um, ukulele for beginners and intermediate players who really just want a comfortable ukulele. Um, the other thing is they're really, really indestructible. So strong plastic back and sides. You can actually stand them up in their lower belt as well, which is cool. So in between teaching, I use these for teaching when I go up to Spain. Um, you can put them on the floor when you're not using them, which is really great. Um, you don't have to worry about humidity changes and things like that. So they're really hardy, which is absolutely fantastic. As I said, so comfortable to play as well. I think of them as strumming ukes. If you want to kind of have a ukulele to strum away and sing songs, take them to a club and festivals, these are absolutely perfect. And as I say, I have two of these which I travel with. So when I'm really worried about kind of damaging one of my favourite ukuleles, I'll take these out, which are really solid, and they'll come on in the overhead locker of a plane with me. So let's just do a quick sound comparison. I thought these three would be interesting because we have one with the laminate top and the plastic fingerboard. Now, the plastic fingerboard, don't look down on these at all because the intonation from having a plastic moulded fretboard is incredible. So these are really comfortable to play and they sound absolutely fantastic. For those that like the traditional wooden fretboard, which is going to last a lot longer, I've got two with wooden fretboards. This one has walnut, this one has maple. And the difference between these two is that this one has the pine top again, which is like a laminate top. This one has a solid color top, so you can hear the difference in the sound. All of them also have a zero fret. Do you notice that fret right next to the note? Again, this is another way of getting that action, the string height, really, really low, but having excellent intonation and really nice quality um, peg tunes. <laughs> Thank you. 
So let me know what you think. I think everyone should have one of these in their collection. They're just so iconic and so cool and so comfortable and fun to play. I'll see you again in another Uke Demo soon. Take care, everyone.